Welcome back to the vlog guys. Uh, today we've got a BRZ, it's a wide body kit on here. Um, it's a rally backer version two. I'm gonna be taking apart this whole wide body kit along with the rest of the car. Just took off the whole kit on the on one side of the car. This is the driver's side. It's just crazy how this kit is actually made because there's a bunch, a bunch of pieces all along the car. It's just, you know, front and back, you know. Just give you guys an example. This is one piece, that's a piece. This is a separate piece. This is a piece right here too. The over fenders right here is a piece, and then the bumper part is a piece as well. Honestly, it wasn't that hard taking it off. I heard that the customer installed it himself, and I think he did a pretty good job. He used nut inserts, so instead of riveting on, he used the nut inserts, which makes it a lot easier to take off of the car. There's a lot of oxidation going on. You can see from the hood, it just looks all like dried out, and you know you can barely even see the carbon anymore. The headlights also have oxidation right here, so. We are probably gonna call in someone to uh, correct this for us. It's probably gonna be flossing. What up guys, we got the 86 behind me, it's the BRZ. We've done a ton of these, if you've seen them on Instagram, they look great when they're done, but this is what they look like when they're naked. The color we're going with is Avery Dennis' Supreme Wrap Film, matte, purple, metallic. Right now we're gonna wrap the quarter pound of the door all the way through, but most of it's covered. Just so you know, we're gonna do this all in one piece, but most of it's covered. All one shot, quarter panel door. You guys are asking why we're doing it that way, because you guys see on our channel. Sometimes we do door separately, quarter panel separately, uh, and that's in most cases. But with this one, because of what we're doing here, we don't need to. So one shot, we're gonna knock it out. On a Tesla? So, mirror base, yep. window trim, the side for the fender stuff, okay. the two pieces on the grill. So, it's an easy project besides the mirrors. Yeah, no. And the mirrors add the price. The, you know the normal chrome delete price. I just emphasize to them, we've done it, we know how to do it, this is the way you do it. You've got to take that mirror apart, it's the only way. Is the customer here? Uh, very good estimate. There's a couple things you can do here. You can wrap those back plates in gloss black, so it just looks exactly the same but it's that layer of protection. So when that gets scratched up, you just remove that gloss black and you can rewrap it. I feel like doing a gloss black vinyl is the best because you're gonna get the same elements as uh, the clear film. Uh, it's just gonna be cheaper. You know, it'll be a little bit cheaper. And that's the lower price that I quoted. It was a pleasure to meet you. I'm Daniel, take care. All right, All right brother, take nice care, man. You. Yeah, absolutely. I hope okay. we can work with you guys. All right, guys, that's kind of what my day consists of. We kind of jump around between things. Someone got my ear over here, someone got my ear over here, someone got my little... Stop! You're making me nervous. Let's wrap, <laughs> let's wrap. We're gonna emboss the premium logo on the 
good scoop. If the customer wanted to have some premium logos on it, that'd be a really cool place to do it. And he kind of gave us free range, so I hope you love it, man. But I love doing this, it looks really cool. This is one of those spots that you see all the time. Typically when, you, when you're viewing the masterpiece, you look right here and you start from the center. So it's gonna be a cool spot. What I did right here is I have made inlays right here on the scoop, right here and here. Now I'll be able to wrap the entire scoop and that'll be branded into it for life. Show you guys a wrap. I'm gonna show you something that I'm doing that a lot of you guys, other rappers, will kind of look at and say that's controversial. You shouldn't do that. What I'm talking about is when it comes to this trunk right here. Obviously, it's off right now. When we wrap this trunk, the approach that I'm gonna take is a little different than some of you guys would do. I'm gonna wrap it in two pieces because I have the ability to do so. Uh, the reason is, is we have a wing here that's gonna cover all this. And what it's gonna do for me is if I do it in these in two pieces, it's gonna make sure that in this area, I can make sure that the material is not discolored and it's not overstretched. When you're doing trunks, that does tend to happen because you're having to work the material, you have to bring it down. And of course we can do it with you know one piece. We've done that millions of times. It's how we do all, almost all trunks. Let me show you guys what it looks like. I believe the seam is gonna be 100% invisible. I know it's gonna be once the wing goes on because it covers all of that. So like I said, that's why I'm doing it in two pieces if you guys are asking. Um, if it didn't have a wing, of course we do it in one piece, but we don't have to in this case. So let's get to it. Knife was tape first.
Darren and John just finished up wrapping all the uh, white body pieces and this car is finally ready to get reassembled. So now we're gonna get the headlights on all the smaller pieces and then we're gonna move on to the white body pieces. Banner's done, that's the last final touch. Um, there's one of two things that I really enjoy the most. It's finishing the car, putting the banner on, and seeing the customer reaction. But there's one other little step that happens in the middle here. Oh shit, I didn't mean to hit you that hard. I'm sweating. This guy's about to shoot cinematics, my favorite part of the videos. If you guys like the cinematics that he shoots, comment below. If you don't, just we'll, don't comment. We'll find somebody else to start shooting him. So you guys wow. be the judge. Let's get over to this spot. We gotta I'm offer my job up on a vlog right now. Hey man, it is what it is. We're about to go shoot some dope ass cinematics. No pressure. I gotta go film. Let's for go film. I, gotta, I gotta go film for TJ, dude. Sorry. TJ Hunt. He's don't looking for want a filmer. You, bro. Later, man. TJ Hunt. Later. <laughs> Black and purple looks so good, yeah. dude. And it matches the harness, it's perfect. Yeah. So where's this car going? You live up north? I live in San Francisco. Oh, okay, got it. So yeah. it's going back up north, right? Yeah. See, the last couple customers we've had have been from up there. Yeah. It's wild. Oh yeah, we're trips me out. We're I getting think we the need name to open out there. a shop out over there. Yeah. We're yeah. definitely getting the name premium out there in the bay. Man, it's dope. I mean, yeah. it's cool. I appreciate you driving out here. I know that you could have went to ten other, no. not ten other brothers, hundreds <laughs> of other places <laughs> yeah. you could have went to. You know? No, only premium. Appreciate it. Trust. Thank you, man. I wanted to say congrats. Thank you so much. Farm. Yeah, man. Yeah, it's honestly everything. Just nice to meet you, buddy. Yeah, dude. We'll be here next. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you guys. Uh, any closing up? I gotta go wrap. <laughs> okay, uh,